This alkaloid is an amazing antibacterial, antiviral, but more, more than anything else, it really seems to be specific for bacteria. It is like one of the, this is one of the solutions or one of the contenders or one of the players in a flesh-eating staff MRSA-like event. It can hold its own. It might be the total remedy. Might need to add a few other things. But man, that, that alone makes this worth knowing about. It is also one of our great bitter digestive stimulants. Organ grape root is so good for your tummy, for your upper GI, in returning your, 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 your secretions and your, your excess secretions or your lack of secretions back to balance or homeostasis. Anywhere from H. pylori to heartburn to like dry gut to where you're not making any secretions. Man, Mahonia should be tried. It's a contender. It can do more for your upper and lower GI to return it to normal, help you digest better. It can be used in things from H. pylori, upper GI stomach ulcer, to all the way down to ulcerative colitis, irritable bowel syndrome, uh, SIBO, that small intestinal bacterial overgrowth, um, to leaky gut syndrome, to, you know, like all of those problems, Mahonia, I've seen, not all the time, but all of those problems, some of the time, Mahonia is the remedy. That's just really good to know. This is really one of the great medicines to, re especially in our culture, standard American diet, standard American stress patterns, um, you know, standard American way of life with, when it comes to health and diet and upper and lower GI and all those health problems associated with it. There's probably no other plant that I think of first as a possible remedy than Mahonia. And, and this one specifically. For the full video and for more plant teachings, visit Wild Medicine School at the link below.